Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel again. Today I'm not in my like filming studio or anything. I'm actually in my bathroom, but oh, I'm in my bathroom. You're like kind of in the doorway. Um, so I realized I need to clean out my bathroom. I was about to have a shower and I was like, you know what? I need to do a bathroom clean out. So I figured I would bring you guys along with me. Sorry, my whole body can't fit in the frame. I'm not using a wide lens. So you guys are just gonna have to bear with me and I hope it's okay. I've gotten a basket, this is actually a laundry basket. But it really hurts to talk after biting yourself, you know. Um, but I'm gonna put all my junk in here because I feel like there's a lot of products that have expired or are finished and I'm just hoarding and holding on. I will show you a quick clip of my vanity, which is where I'm putting all my um, like face skincare and makeup and stuff. So I'm moving all of that out of here. I only wanna keep like my body stuff and hair stuff in here, and candles and stuff. So. Everything else is getting chucked. Let's start. Um, so this is obviously my mirror um, and sink and stuff. So I have my toothbrush here, and I have a um, like a soap thing, soap thing. So I'm gonna leave these both here and put toothpaste in here with it. Um, this is an old face wash, but I don't want to throw it away. I mean, I don't, I probably should because it's been so long, but I'm going to keep this one still. Um, so I now need to decide how I'm going to arrange everything. I think I'm going to put them in this corner. So I'm just going to tilt this a little bit so you can see more what I'm doing. Okay, so in this corner, this is where I'm going to put my face washes and things, but I think I need to move stuff. I don't even know how to start this process. So maybe what I'm going to do first is just move all my stuff into the sink. Okay, so I need to figure out how I'm gonna arrange things. I don't know if I'm gonna do, I think I'm gonna do skin care, like face, and then body, because basically when they were building this, I don't know if you can see, but it doesn't come out enough, and I can't really stack tubs, which is what a lot of my hair products come in, so I'm not gonna put this here, because it's just pointless in my opinion. Um, so I'm gonna put hair stuff here, and skin care here. How am I gonna? do that now. So I'm going to move the hair care stuff. So first thing I need to do is actually check what's empty and what's not. I know I have a lot of empties here. So this is my problem. I have things that are like almost empty and then I just don't do anything with it. So I can't, I'm sorry, I can't throw this away and not. Like do you know how expensive these products are? They're like 20 pounds each. So this is one mix of a wash and I'm just not getting rid of it. So I'm going to move all my deep conditioners conditioners, shampoos, and like stack them like that. So this is a co-wash, so I'm gonna start with co-washes. Um, the only reason I'm actually putting my main, my big conditioners here is because I put leave-in conditioners like in my vanity, things that I actually put on my, um, on my hair, like the stuff I use in the shower, I feel like they should be in the bathroom just for like ease of access. That's a leave in, that's a leave in, so these both go to the bathroom. So I, there's, I have two Olori's. Ideally what I should now do is empty them both into one. But this is not Olori, this is actually Shea Butter. Typical Nigerian household, I don't know who did this. I also have two of these. So I'm gonna empty the almost finished one one but is it brand new like is there even space nope it's brand new there's no space okay so that's fine now deep conditioners deep conditioner so this is a deep conditioner this is Olori I have some hair mayonnaise I have this so this is why I don't need to keep all these empties I mix my deep conditioners in here 
these little containers have old product in them that I used to use to move around, but now obviously these products would just be so bad. So I'm gonna chuck these in here, but I'm gonna keep the bottles and throw out what's inside. These are gone. Trash, trash. I'm gonna put my oils just in front like this. I don't wanna like take up too much of my mirror space. Yeah, so I hand wash my underwear actually. I don't like leaving my underwear in my, in my laundry and it just gets like dirty and like nasty. So I always have a bowl of like Omo or Priscilla or whatever that is. I don't know why it's up here. So I'm gonna move this just to like a little shelf. There's like a little thing there. So I'm just gonna put it on the little shelf. Um, this, like I said, is body, so I'm gonna put it on for a minute. Um, so basically these are my acne org stuff and I think it's about time I throw these away I've had them for years now. I kind of just poured it onto them because they're so good but Acne org you've done me a solid but now you have to go. I just need to order new ones like bye This foaming cleanser is really good. This is the Aveeno with salicylic acid. Um, my dog's shampoo. I think I'm just gonna put with my shampoo. Um, I hope nobody tries to use it. Um, this is my makeup brush cleanser. I am going to leave here because whenever I wash my brushes, I do it in here anyway. So I think this makes more sense. Um, this is my skin brush that I use. I haven't used it in a while, so this is supposed to actually stay in the shower. Oh my god, there's so much more stuff in here. Inside my shower, I always, always have a foot scrub to make sure my feet stay smooth. And obviously a shaving stick. Um, for my candles, I think I'm going to put my candles like, just lay them here for easy access. So this is my favorite candle. This is the Nora Perrier champagne candle. It doesn't smell like champagne, but it smells really sweet and nice. I also have the candle from my niece's baby shower, um, my sister's baby shower, gender reveal before my niece was born. Um, I have one from Sentimental Nigeria. Okay, this is obviously just when I travel, I always put my toothbrush in one of these, and I like to keep this like near my toothbrush so I don't forget. This is just an empty bottle like the one I showed you before, so when I'm moving around, I put stuff in this. Um, like for example, if I'm going from my friend to my friend's house or whatever for the weekend, I don't want to take my whole face wash bottle, which is this big. I just pour some in here and then be on my way. Which is the Aveeno Daily Moisturizing Yogurt Body Wash. These are my body scrubs. I'm gonna put these next to my um, conditioners and stuff. And then this is gonna like, be the body section. This is this coconut oil exfoliating salt scrub and it's amazing, this one. Um, this is another one of my scrubs from Macariah Scrubs. I really like this one. This is the Calcot Manor. This one is just a cheap one from, I think, Boots or something. This is the ameliorate one. I really like this one. This one makes me smell like a baby, like a baby, like a like an adult baby. My Hawaii candle. Um, I have this basket here, and this is my like go around wash bag. So like I was showing you, this is my go around sponge, which I just leave dry in here, and then I have some face wash in here. And so I just sort of keep this in my bathroom. I have a bunch of shower caps, which have stretched which I'm just going to chuck out now um, a lot of things just sort of get lost in this basket if I'm being honest and like all these shower cups have just been stretched out these ones are even plastic ones that just won't go there's a whole ass cable in here that I don't even know what this is for these shaving sticks are still good though they're new so why SMH so this is where I like if I take off my bra or something or like I don't know I just chuck things in here that it's, it's like a it's like the couch in your room for me basically. I have some savon and some disinfectant stuff in case we have bugs. I'm gonna put these like I have a little um so let me show you actually. So I have a compartment that opens up right there. And that's where I put like my tissue, my disinfectant, and all this stuff in that little thing. So I'm gonna put like plasters and like, antiseptic wipes. Um, some more plasters. So all these are my sinus and medicine things. And I always have something to 
Okay, so after I've thrown away all those shower cups, new one, I'm gonna take all the leave ends back into where they're supposed to be. Okay, so here's another view, which is down here. This is actually the place of my bathroom I haven't touched in a good amount of time. Um, so I'm pretty sure that everything in here can go. This is some really old gel. I want to keep this container. I don't know what this is either, but I like the container. So again, I'm going to keep the container. Container, you know, Dr. Super High Maintenance. Intense repair and protection cream. I feel like this was my mom's and I just took it from her closet. And then I never returned it and now it's expired. And it was really expensive. Oh, shit. Paul Mitchell Foaming Pomade. Paul Mitchell is good. We gonna keep this and see what we can do. So yeah, that's pretty much it. That is pretty much my bathroom, my shower. Um, that would took a lot shorter than I thought it would. I thought it was gonna take me forever, so I'm really glad. I do have dirty hands now, and I am ready to get in the shower, so. Hope you guys have enjoyed doing this with me, actually talking through with you guys. Oh, I forgot to show you what's in here. This is just where I keep all my like bath rugs um, and stuff. And before I close out, actually, let me show you how I keep my towels. All my towels. And this is where I was telling you I keep my um, toilet bags and things. Um, I have a scale underneath, bin, toilet brush, and then this is where I hang. I'm not going to show you everything, but that's where I hang all my underwear that's been washed. So yeah, that's pretty much it. That is my bathroom tour. Um, my arranging bathroom tour, whatever you want to call this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I'm going to get naked and get into the shower now and start the rest of my day. And I will see you guys in my next one.